Aliens Expanded is just around the corner, everybody. The new documentary, an epic celebration of James Cameron's beloved film, has been completed and is in its last round of orders. This came with a major update, as after months of believing James Cameron unfortunately wouldn't be involved, it was revealed he finally sat down for an interview. You see, me and Jim, we've always been looking for a project to do together, and we thought this was a good fit. I'm glad he joined me for the ride. I joke, of course. His involvement has nothing to do with me, but the incredible efforts of the team behind Aliens Expanded who fought so hard for so long to get him to come aboard. Basically, when it comes to the behind-the-scenes stuff, the makers of the documentary had an advisor panel to get a sense of what hardcore Aliens fans would want out of it. Specifically, when it came to the interviewees, Cameron was always the number one ask. Every so often, we'd get some updates, offer some feedback, we were able to take a look at a rough version of the documentary while it was still being fine-tuned, and even then we knew it was something special. We knew it properly and beautifully expressed all of the affection we have for the film, and why we continue to have affection for it, woven into behind-the-scenes accounts from those that were there in a way we've never quite seen before in these types of documentaries. It all would have worked amazingly, but to get Cameron interviewed and offer his own insights, it's just going to make something great even better. Some pretty intense editing was involved, I'm sure, but I think you'd agree it's worth it. So he's now part of the documentary, along with new interviews with countless talents involved with the film like Michael Bean, Lance Henriksen, Jeanette Goldstein, Carrie Henn, Rico Ross, to name a few. I mean, they got just about everybody. This includes film critics, fans of the film, yes, I'm in there too, and many involved with the overall expanded universe, from the comics to the novels, video games, you name it. So it's a comprehensive documentary. It was done with love and affection from the fans, for the fans, and it's really exciting that its release is imminent. I've been with the project from an advisor position since its very beginning, and truly it's been incredible to see this project come from its beginnings now to its final form. All starting with the ideas from director Ian Nathan and producer Robin Block to a fully-fledged reality that I'm really honored to be a part of. I mean, it really struck me as really real, once bloody disgusting, reported on it yesterday. Cameron's involvement struck up all kinds of new interests, and the excitement has been ramping up. We're almost there. Of course, I've talked about the documentary in previous update and announcement videos, but if you're newer to the channel and not quite sure what this is, here's a good explanation from the press release put out yesterday. A brand new extended interview with directing phenomenon James Cameron heads up the revolutionary documentary experience Aliens Expanded. Helmed by the creators of In Search of Darkness, Aliens Expanded brings fans on an unparalleled journey into the extraordinary cinematic legacy of the greatest sequel of all time. Cameron's 1986 genre masterpiece, Aliens. Coupled with interviews with Michael Bean as Corporal Hicks, Lance Henriksen as Bishop, and many more cast and crew, Aliens Expanded is a first-of-its-kind scene-by-scene analysis of Aliens with James Cameron leading the conversation. Pre-sale of Aliens Expanded opens on April 9th, 2024, and until May 5th, 2024. Writer and director Ian Nathan, author of Alien Vault, and James Cameron, a retrospective, teams up with the award-winning creator VC to explore Cameron's finest film to date. The ultimate celebration of a classic, the film is centered on an in-depth analysis, as well as a wealth of memories, stories, facts, revelations, never-before-heard stories from set, and discussion over the massive cultural impact the film had and still has today. This is the opportunity of a lifetime, says writer and director Ian Nathan. I've been gripped by Aliens from the day I saw it, and it has never let me go. I delved for the roots of what makes it so addictive. With a wealth of incredible fresh insight from cast and crew as well as experts and critics, and above all from the fans, I think this is the definitive statement on one of the greatest films of all time. Made by fans for fans, Aliens Expanded supporters can be part of history in the making with pre-order packages made available at www.aliens-expanded.com. Offering unique opportunities for limited-run merchandise, limited Blu-ray editions of the film, and their name in the credits, fans can get their hands on their own piece of Aliens Expanded, slated for limited release in June 2024. With the final rounds of orders, it's the last chance to purchase the exclusive packages for the launch, which comes with perks such as having your name in the credits. So this is it. It's game time. From now until May 5th, 2024. 
Digital versions become available in June, and the physical copies arrive in July. I'll leave a link down below that you can follow for more information, and I'll leave you with the new trailer for Aliens Expanded. I'm Jim Cameron, and this is Aliens Expanded. Talk to me, Hudson! Multiple signals! Without a doubt, Aliens is the best movie that I've ever been in. We all knew that we had something. If you're gonna only be in one movie, this was the movie to be in. I don't think we had seen that in film before. It was so real. It's brilliant. It's so fresh, it's so exciting, so adrenal. Let's pack them in! Get in there! I want this thing to go smooth and by the numbers. Paxton turned to me and he was like, Oh dude, this is gonna be so awesome! This wasn't just a hit movie, it was something that would really undo it. A phenomenal piece of filmmaking. I'd been on a lot of sets, but this one was a next level. In my mind, it was experimental cinema. Everybody thought I was nuts. Is he gonna be casual? Is he gonna be a monster? He was under pressure. If you're screwing around, he's gonna tell you. A little bit of abuse doesn't hurt. And it all just went dark. Six. Remember, short controlled bursts. Just shock and awe. We were all cheering for Sigourney. She goes 100% feral. But she's got the gun and the flamethrower. She's alive. There's still time. It definitely is movie history. It was a great time in my life. Get away from her, you bitch! I was born to make that movie. Game over, man. It's game over.